One of the things that I have been trying to be better at this year as far as gardening goes is uh, fertilizing my annuals. Last year, I, um, I probably only fertilized twice for the whole season. And I know that's not ideal, but you know, life happens sometimes. Uh, but I told myself this year, I should uh, be better at fertilizing my annuals because they can do way better with a fertilizer on a certain schedule and uh, then just be in by themselves. So I told myself that I was going to do it weekly. Uh, in reality, I think it's going to be more like two weeks. It is what it is. I'm going to, you know, work at it. Um, I am not the best at having a calendar or having um, a to-do list on every week. Uh, I just kind of get outside, see what needs to be done, and I do it instead of thinking, oh, today is Monday or today is Tuesday. I have to do this and that. I, it's just kind of how it works for me. So let me show you what I have. Um, this is the stuff that I used last year and the year before. I, I like it. I think that it works. It is... Um, available at your local stores. I think that you can get them really cheap as well. And then I think Amazon has them. This is the stuff that I'm going to be using for most of my annuals. Everything in containers and in uh, flower beds. I think this is what's going to work for me. But also I watch a couple of YouTubers that grow dahlias and also a couple of dahlia growers. And they mentioned that they use this for dahlias. Um, and that it works great. So I am going to be using this for dahlias that I have in containers and that I have in the ground as well. And uh, hopefully that works for me. I don't know how it's going to go, but uh, I'm going to put link for both of these in the description so that you can find them on Amazon. Um, I don't think that at the time that I was looking for these, Amazon had it, but I know that I got these at Home Depot. and I don't know about Lowe's, but check your local store, see if they have them. Also, you guys, I am right where the camera is, which is far away from me. Um, that's where the honeysuckles are. And oh my gosh, you guys, they are exquisite. Actually, there is a hummingbird right now. Uh, of course, I am not set up. And if I move the hummingbird, yep, it went away. The hummingbirds have found all of my honeysuckles. I have three on the wall that they're absolutely in bloom right now. They're, the perfume is exquisite. I mean, there is no other word to describe it. And the one behind me, the one by the water fountain, it's still blooming. I mean, it's still going and I still see some of uh, new buds coming up. I mean, I think I'm just gonna have a really long uh, blooming period for that and I love it. And also another thing that I just, I show you earlier in the video is I am going to be saving my um, dry or span allium blooms. I think that I am going to be doing a couple of DIYs for um, maybe the summer, maybe Christmas time, I don't know, but I'm going to dry them. And if I think of something or if I get inspired by someone else doing something, then I'll have them already in hand. So, um, that's it for this video, you guys. I hope that you guys have a great week in your garden and until the next video.